Hey Butterfly Beauty, so you're probably here like, what is going on? I'm trying to um, figure out how to position this so we can see this pretty good. But this is just a box, and actually let me do this um, here. So I've already opened the package just so that we can see what's in it, but I received a social light screen. So um, we're going to be trying some stuff. So here's the package so we can see it. So it's called the social light. The instructions, it's something that I saw on Instagram and my buddy Elaine, she sent this to me um, when I was like asking anyone, has anyone used this, bought it, etc. Um, and I'm currently on a no buy and I said, okay, it's going to go on my list and I was trying to see if anyone had any feedback and Elaine said she was going to send it. So it is the mini socialite LED dimmable ring light selfie stick uh, for suiting social media photos and or videos uh, so this basically kind of tells you what it comes with and how to set it up there's other options was to set up the tripod attach the selfie stick to a tripod attach your smartphone to it and all that kind of good stuff so it kind of tells you then how to do it um, with the uh, desktop I don't know but we'll look at that I just wanted to show you those pieces so this has the remote so you can see that it has oh I guess you can't see sorry so this is going to be the remote let's see so for the camera and then I guess this is for video or something I don't know we'll have to read the instructions for real so in the box you get this which is the uh, mini tripod this I'm assuming is the actual ring light and the tripod or um, selfie stick so the only thing is that with my um, camera oh there we go sorry guys I was doing this um, all types around I forgot I zoomed in earlier during the video but anyways um, so these are the three things that you get in the box besides the instructions so the mini tripod let's see here Is this is what is the seat so it opens like this and then you'll put the selfie stick on it so with the selfie stick it acts as the arm of the so you have the strap that's here so you can attach it um, don't know how you'll attach it I'll drop something I guess the instructions uh, you'll attach it somehow I don't know where or how but we'll see it gets attached but here's it has a good rubber grip so I like that so it gives you for that it's got a heavy kind of a nice feel we've got the um, items to lock and load it if you will so that we can extend it so you have three extenders so this will extend it out you know this part goes this far and then you lock it or you can open it back up so it comes back down you can extend this part if you choose to so this is the second part or just choose to do this arm piece this is where your cell phone would go so kind of how I have it now so I don't know that it will hold my phone with a case in it um, this has an adjuster it seems so yeah so I guess you can take this piece off the base but you can um, what I like is that you can do it this way so that your phone can go you know like this and it have complete flush so you can video straight down so that's how you can utilize with the arm so this portion of the stick itself so of course if you want it to face this way so I like that it can go, you know, you can have it facing you as a, with the selfie stick or have it facing completely down if you choose to. Um, so you just have to angle it how you'd want to angle it so you can turn it. You just have to be careful when you turn it because you're basically unscrewing it. Um, and I, I don't know what this does. I don't know if this gives it a kind of an angle. So I guess the part would be we could truly read the instructions, right? But what fun would that be? So this does unscrew it because I'm doing that and it's coming undone. So let's not do that because I want to keep that on there. But then you'll take this portion and you'll stick this in. So let me 
do it here so you guys can see it in frame. Well, let me do it this way. Hello. So this becomes a part of your tripod. So you notice that it has almost, yeah, like a 360 angle. So it will hold up. So now you've got a larger tripod here. And then again, so I'm going to show you. So forgive me if it gets wobbly. I just wanted to show you it being on the base. So here is where it's facing. This is this way. So of course I wouldn't want it this way. I would want it this way because I would have my phone sit in it. So you've got that flip or 180, I guess would be the way that you'd want to say it. Right? So my phone would fit in here and then it can look directly down. And then I can adjust the height because at this point I can just lift this portion up and we can lift this up to get height that we need. So we have it on three different levels. So let's take a look at the ring light. Okay, so this is the ring light. So as we know that I'm always the one, um, only time I really have time is for uh, videos at night. So it has a, it clips. So it has the batteries that are in the back for the ring light. And then it's supposed to clip. So here's the lights. So it has three settings. Now I don't know how this is supposed to clip because it doesn't really open wide. Hmm. So definitely need to read the instructions for this. So I don't want to break it. Alright, so I've got to figure this out because this should clamp open, right? And then you set the ring light in it. Uh, but here is the brightness, so it has three settings. So here's one. And then you'll do it, and so you'll see there's that wave of light. So I guess for you not to have really the wave of light, you need to have it on the highest setting. So let's turn off this light. So now we're in the dark. And here's our setting, so we would have it like this. So you see it's got this wave of light, not good. And then we'll do second setting. It's bright because this should be, would be over my camera, right? Over my phone, because it should clip on. So that's the second wave of light. And then you hit it one more time for the third. So it needs to be, it looks like on the third setting in order for you to not get that wave of light. So that's how it bright it is. I couldn't see this like facing me because it's talking about, I couldn't do a selfie with this like that's super bright in my face if I was doing it facing me. So you can see how bright that is. So that's on the third level. So you don't get the wave. Second level. Um, let me find where the say again is blind me because here on the top. So first level, but you notice the lines. Second, and then third is where you're um, basically good to go. So we will be playing around with this to see how this will actually work. Um, again, I don't know why this doesn't open all the way unless I'm missing something uh, because this needs to open. So that I can um, clip it to my phone. But we shall see because I don't want to break it. So I'll be back and see if I can get it open. Okay y'all, so I'm back. Uh, it took me a minute. So you see these pieces down here. My phone is in an otter box. So if your phone is in an otter box, it is not um, the tripod selfie stick is not going to fit with uh, around the otter box so I tried it so I will have to always take it out of the case and this basically was stuck so it took me a minute I was scared but I finally got it unhinged so that you can open it so also if you left your otter box on and you tried to put it over the case the ring light doesn't go far enough down so then you'll have it in the view um, here, so you see it's kind of in the view. I said, again, this is 
I'll turn the lights back off where I'm mostly at night. So you really need to keep it on the third setting for it not to have that flowing light. So that's kind of a, a I guess a bummer in a way, but not really. Um, so it's a kind of saying two useless um, settings because it gives you those lines. So why would you want to use that setting? So I'm just going to take it and I will just clip it. And now I have the additional light. So now you can see so much better, right? And then I can have my other light that I have in the background. So I have plenty of light to do recording at night. So I just need to now get it set up so I can see what's happening and making sure that I'm in frame and all that kind of good stuff. So I'm super excited about that. Uh, so again, this was, I'm taking my alt light, turning that off. So this is just purely the selfie light. And it's wobbling because as you guys can see in the frame, it's on the chair right now. Um, I was just trying to look. So then it has this remote. And let's see. I didn't even try to see. So it comes with the battery. And you're supposed to be able to Bluetooth it. Yeah, so let me put this battery in. So let's see what the struggles of me trying to... Put this in. And then I will have to come back with to you guys. Um, plus side down. So how does this go? This is the remote shutter. Oh no, hello. This way, yeah. Oh yeah, because it tells you here's the plus symbol. Duh. So really, I just have to figure out how to get this truly kind of set up. So can I get this in here? Seriously now? Alrighty, so I will be back. Let me finish trying to get this in here and then tell you if it works with the Bluetooth. So I'm holding the camera right now, but I wanted to tell you that the remote does work. It doesn't turn the video mode on, but it will take pictures. And it doesn't matter if you, um, at least on my Galaxy, it doesn't matter if I hit the Android button or the camera 360 iOS. Now it says it doesn't zoom um, on the Apple phone, but you can on this phone. So I don't know how you zoom and it says with the volume keys I guess once I have it in this mode but I don't see how that worked out um, but it does say I can go somewhere on load to keep up with Android's um, items because when I'm using the volume key it doesn't do that and there's no volume key um, on here so yep that's the quick info on the social light I'm super amped I just now need to figure out where to put this stand so that I can see one that I'm in frame and do the video. So um, good news or good things to come hopefully. So I'll see you guys in another video. Bye-bye.